loves, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name's Anushka. And we are on day six of the reviews. Oh my God, guys. I don't think I've ever done so many reviews in like such a short period of time. But today we're actually trying out the Morphe Filter Effect Soft Focus Foundation. I have been dying to try this. I actually went into Selfridges and color matched myself. Of course, before we jump into the video, we're gonna do our post notification shout out. And today's one's gonna go to Anushka Parkamsetti. So girl with name matching but yeah thank you so much for hitting that notification bell button i really appreciate it and if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below when you have done so so you actually can get the morphe foundation on the cult beauty website it's a bit more accessible you don't have to go to suffrages but it is helpful to be able to color match and um, i love the shade range they have 40 shades it's oil free it's long wearing medium coverage blurs and diffuses the look of imperfections whilst hydrating and nourishing the skin uh, medium to full coverage sweat proof transfer proof waterproof plus it stays put for 12 hours it has a hyaluronic acid glycerin and vitamin e to nourish and hydrate um, ultimately promoting a soft supple finish that will have your complexion looking and feeling so good so yeah this sounds pretty good it's affordable let's just hope for the best guys this is what the bottle looks like and i chose the shade uh filter tan 19 I think the shade match is just going to be on point. Just put it everywhere. To be honest, I don't mind a matte foundation as long as it doesn't make my skin dry. Okay, so that size with a sponge. Let's try this with a brush. So this said it was like a medium to full coverage. She's so shocked that the shade match literally on point. I do prefer it with a sponge though. And to be honest, whenever I work with um, matte liquid foundations, I do prefer more sponge because it just adds in a bit more hydration from the like the dampness of the sponge. I think I'm gonna have to start color correcting these scars. They are taking so long to go. I mean, it's looking pretty good. Pretty good, guys. Okay, let me just do the rest of my makeup and let's see how this looks. All right, guys, I've done my makeup. Make sure to follow me on Instagram if you wanna see how I got this look. I've literally just went all out on the blush and I'm loving it. I'm wearing the EX1 Pretty in Peach blush, one of my all-time favorites. But yeah, I feel like I'm really gonna like this foundation. I'm getting slight smile lines, but I like how flawless this makes my skin look. So like, if I'm going out for like dinner or something, like I would be happy to reach for this because it just makes your skin look so flawless honestly i've just been used to more skin tints and tinted moisturizers where like i can see my skin through it and it just looks like skin whilst this looks like you've got makeup on but it just looks absolutely flawless like doll like and you know every now and then i don't mind that like it looks so good it is now 8 35 a.m so i'm gonna wear this for the rest of the day i'm gonna try and wear it as long as possible um and then yeah we'll see how this looks but i'm gonna do a quick close-up for you guys do you guys see what i mean about the smart lines I think that's just normal. I mean, it looks nice. No dryness and it feels matte. I didn't even set it. Let's just hope for the best. I mean, if this is bomb, like, I'm so happy that I've discovered another drugstore flawless foundation. So we'll see, we'll see. All right, guys, it's now 5.17 p.m. and I've had this on for quite a while. And guys, I literally rate this. This has not even budged one bit. I always end up with no lipstick on. But anyways, my makeup is intact. It looks flawless. It looks a little bit glowy. You know, I've got a bit of a shine. But smile lines, there's nothing. It stayed put. But I didn't wear any masks today, so I feel like that can maybe play with the foundation a bit. But to, to be honest, I've been laying in bed and stuff and haven't haven't seen anything transfer and like it's not transferring on my hands at all. So yeah, it's really, de it's definitely transfer proof. Um, I was trying to learn these TikTok dances and I get really sweaty. So like definitely sweat proof too. It's long wearing, it stay, it's just stayed put. Yeah, my blush is still on too. Like I'm just so shocked right now. It's so good. Next time I'm going out to eat, I want flawless skin, like this is what I'm gonna be reaching 
out for yeah i don't really have anything bad to say it's got an amazing shade range it's affordable i love discovering um drugstore foundations that work amazingly so yeah this is just bomb bomb.com so yeah i definitely definitely recommend this if you're looking for a foundation try and go in stores and get a shade match that's always better and you know like you're gonna get it on point yeah this one's a 10 out of 10 for me i'm going to give it, i'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 so yeah i hope you found this review helpful we've got one more left guys i mean i'll continue to review stuff but there's less pressure on me to like upload like daily even though it was really hard to and i skipped some days but you know we move we move i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe if you haven't already give this video a like because it really helps your girl out and i will see you in my next video bye i need to do my nails ew